For people with life-threatening food allergies, the EpiPen is the first line of treatment. But the price of the pen has gone sky high, retailing at more than $600 for a pack of two in New York City. But what if a pill could one day replace the needle? Leslie Mouton has details. They're dairy, nut, soy, and gluten-free. Jamie Riskin and her daughter Gabby spend a lot of time reading food labels. They don't tell you I'm allergic to nuts and shellfish. They found out Gabby had severe food allergies when she was two and her preschool served peanut butter. She was covered in hives and her whole face swelled up. Experts say food allergies in this country are on the rise. About 3% of the children might uh, be at risk of fatal anaphylactic reactions due to food allergies. The first line of treatment uh, should be epinephrine. That means families like the Riskins need to keep an EpiPen with them at all times. There's always one in her backpack, there's always one in my purse, there's always one at school. Gabby says she hopes she never needs a life-saving treatment. Because it's a needle and I've always been a little scared of needles. So a research team at Nova Southeastern University is working on an easier, more user-friendly option. Using a tablet, a specialized developed tablet under the tongue of the patient. The tablet would deliver the same amount of epinephrine as the injection does, minus the needle. Once you place these tablets under the tongue, they should disintegrate within 10 seconds. I think that the pill is an awesome idea. Until until then, Gabby and her mom will keep the EpiPen on hand and always read the ingredients first. Leslie Mouton, KSAT 12 News.